roll it. Go. <clears throat> okay. Uh, the first five are sort of who am I and then ten sort of bog standard general knowledge. Okay, number one. I'm a writer. I was born in Aldershot in 1948, the son of an army major. One of the less, lesser known facts about me is I wrote the screenplay for the Fly sequel, which was rejected. In the 1970s, I was one of the first people to receive a master's degree in creative writing from East Anglia. Uh, my first published work were the short stories First Love, Last Rites, followed by In Between the Sheets. I'm probably too young, but I'm not going to Nick Hornby on this. Incorrect. Anybody on this uh, one? Oh, let's try to put the right tilt on, that mistake. Sam! Is it proper? No, I... Yeah, I'll pull you in there, Sam, sorry. Carry on. Yeah, well, the cement garden and the comfort of strangers. He's protected his second place, yeah, he's climbing. Yeah, <laughs> Go on, Tony! Ian McEwen. Yes. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Number two, I'm an actress who was born in Kent in 1968. My father was the road manager of the rock band Pink Floyd. Early roles in films include Flirty, 1991, Tack Girl, 1996, and Children of the Corn. Uh, Children of the Corn 4. One of the all time classics. <laughs> so, my better known roles have been in the films 21 Grams. The Ring, Mulholland Drive. Matt, tell me. It's Neil Watts. Neil Watts. She played air in uh, Go on. Okay, the next one is an artist who was born in London in 1963. She was associated with the young British artist. Tell me. Tracy M. Yep. Oh. <laughs> Next one is a comedian born in Southampton. Preston. Benny Hill. That's it. Southampton, <laughs> <laughs> Benny Hill, the only one. That's it. Yes. On Mastermind today, studying comedian from Southampton, it's Matt <laughs> Preston. Go on. Uh, I, I use this phrase very loosely. A showbiz legend <laughs> who was born in Barmouth, North Wales in 1946. As a journalist, I worked as a film and TV critic for The Observer and Sunday Times. I also edited the diaries of Kenneth Williams. From 2009, I've been the host of Brady's Grip. Late on. Oh, sorry, Sam. Davis. Russell Day. Russell Day, yeah. Legend. Legend. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Go on. Okay, these are all just general knowledge. Uh, in space travel, what distinction does a mate Jameson hold? The first non-American in space. No, of course he wasn't like the first silly actor. Ashton. First spacewalk? No. Please. First underage person. No. Lincoln. <laughs> first space tourist. No. Michael. First person to die in space. No. Chris. Roach. First woman in space. No. No. Sam? Those persons have a baby. Sam? No? Go on then, put that in the Oh, Tony! Tony! The oldest person in space. First black woman. Oh. Uh, Oriental small clawed is the smallest species of which creature? Monkey. Oh, yes. Great. Oh, sorry, Chris, you were first anyway. No. Laycock. Crab. Small clod, no. Leaf? Cat. No. Child? Small Lobster. Small no. Debs? Uh, chinchilla. Ashton? Slice. No. Michael? Uh, rabbit. Sam? <laughs> Preston? Guinea pig. No. Elliot? Fat. No. Go on, tell no. us. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm <laughs> oh, oh, we have oh, to go oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> Gather those wagons <laughs> round you, Clive. Let's go. <laughs> uh, Chalga, C-H-A-L-G-A, is a music sort of dance hybrid from which country? Or is it which country? Uh, Portugal. No. Leaves. Brazil. No. Tony. Argentina. No. Daniel. India. No. Michael. Cuba. No. Child. China. No. Debs. Congress. Chris. No. 
Jamaica. Ashton. Cape Verde. I didn't even hear the question. <laughs> no. Go for a more obscure country than Cape Verde, you've got it. Uh, Preston. Spain. Yeah. Lake Up. Mongolia. No. Rhodes. Mexico. Sam. Ireland. Of course. Yep. Yeah. Right. <laughs> of France. Yes. 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 Go on. Who directed the films Spider, Eastern Promises? Oh. Lee's. It's uh, Cronenberg. Yes. Oh. Yes. Ooh. Well, oh, the next one's going to be uh, History of Violence. History of Violence Videodrome? Yep. Okay. Overrated film. <laughs> what, Videodrome? History of Violence. Oh, History of Violence. Violence. Yeah. All right. Which is the largest of Jupiter's moons? Ganymede. Yes. <laughs> You're about to be out everybody. I'll take those off now. Go. Okay. Which was the first Carry On film to feature Sid James? Sergeant. No. Tell me. Captain. No. Lake Up. Cowboy. No. Ashton. Toxic. No. Leeds. Leo. No. Elliot. Nurse. No. Michael. Uh, Chris. Doctor. No. Deb. Spy. No. Daniel. Campin. Giles. No. Sergeant. No. I've said that already. No. Preston. Cabby. No. Rose. Sam. Love it. No. Henry. Michael. No. Constable. Is my love there? Constable. Constable. Oh. Is my love there? Were well, you going to say Constable? <laughs> Don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, no, 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 it doesn't no, work. Again. Don't start that again. <laughs> it's it's right. Right. Every right. bloody month. You're not giving me a chance to guess. Because I'm not giving you a chance to guess. Go on. Take those points. Right. In Japan, what is... One sec. Press your finger. Go. I can't even press this now, never mind me, does it? Go on. In Japan, what is the Hino Maru? Wake up! Bullet train? No. Elliot? A wind? No. Chris? Sumo venue? No. Leaves? Harley. Michael? A flag? It's flag. the flag. Yeah. Oh, that's oh, well, one of us had to be that eventually. Go on then, please, Clive, you are good to go. Which composer's works are catalogued using Dodge numbers? Oh, I don't know, does it? So we'll go for Beethoven, see what that goes to. Marla. Giles. Yeah. Tony. Me. Yeah. Schubert. Yep. Sorry. Last one. Go. Um, which president of the USA was the first to make a phone call? We'll go for you will see that. No. Reasonable guess. Rose. Lincoln. No. That's what I like that one too. Lee's. Garfield. Yes. Yeah. Right here. 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 Okay, we're gonna move straight along here with uh, I liked it last time when he used my question, <laughs> because he's not his own now, which is going to be even tougher. In the Rhodes, uh, in the Steve Kids, Steve Rhodes battle, Steve Kids is currently one point in front of an outright place on an eighth on his own. Come on, Steve, let's do this thing. <laughs> uh, the EGOT is known as the Grand Slam of Entertainment by winning Ashton. Emmy, Grammy, Oscar, Tony. No. And there's the question again. Okay, but it's made to go. Nine people have got the EGOT. Uh, Daniel. Harvest Rider. No. <laughs> <laughs> Harvest Rider. 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 Harvest well, I don't know. Leaves. Vanessa Redgrave? No. <sighs> so, the EGOT is known as the Grand Slam of Entertainment by winning an Emmy, a Grammy, an Oscar, and a Tony. There are currently 12 people on the list. Who is the only British person to win the EGOT? Uh, Leaves. 
Have you gone, Lee? Yeah, I've gone. Uh, Elliot. That one, John? No. Preston. Long Olivia. No. Clive. No weather. No. Michael. Tim Rice. No. Rose. John Gilbert. Correct. Oh, 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 disaster! How did you get a Grammy? <laughs> yes, the I'm glad you're watching, Mark. Right. I'm glad you're watching. Let's do the next one. Okay. In 2010, a cover version of Platinum Blonde's Not In Love was a minor hit for Crystal Castles, which also featured a lead singer of which British band? Tony. Oh, yes. no, um, Paul, uh, no. Lee. Blair. No. Lake up. Mules. Is it? Mules, no. Yes and yes. No. Daniel? No. Rose? No. Sam? Kaiser Chief. No. Preston? Green Day. English, please. Oh, English. <laughs> English. <laughs> Don't worry, I don't think you can. Kim? The Wurzels? No. Uh, Michael? The Wurzels? The Sabian? Elliot? Cranberries? No. Go on. Pull it out. It was Robert Smith from Bikila. Oh. 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 Next yeah. question. In which Northumberland town did the manhunt for Ralph Moore to end? Rose. Oh, yes. No. Ashton. Rothbury. Correct. Ashton, you get two points. Alexander Armstrong was born there. Next one, please. Okay. Go. This is a highbrow question. Oops. Which on, famous then. porn star has launched his own line of dark and spicy? Uh, I'm going to go for John Holmes because it's not highbrow, but go on, minus one. What is the name of the former sports stadium which was located in Harlem, Manhattan? Oh. Lake Oak? No. Minus one. Just one minute. Go on. Where fans used to be able to see the action from Coogan's Bluff. Is it No. Minus one. It was the first home of the New York Giants and was home for the New York Yankees for a decade. Preston? Shea Stadium? No. Oh. That's a Go on. The stadium was knocked down in 1964 to make way for a housing complex near the same. Oh, yes! Daniel? Candlestick Park? No. Oh, yes. Ashton? Project. Sorry? Projects? No. Uh, can I have a go? Tribeca? No. No? It was the Polo Grounds. Okay, next one. This Las Vegas casino is currently one of the oldest on the street. It's one of the five casinos that was robbed during the original Ocean's Eleven. Sam? Gladio. Sorry? Bellagio. No. Okay. Caesar's Palace? No. The current artists in residence are Olivia Newton John and Dolly and Marie Osmond. The construction of the building was bankrolled by the mob and was owned by Bugsy Siegel. Elliot? Caesar's Palace? No. No. Lake Up? Wynn? No. Michael? Sahara? No. Deb? Luxor? No. Leaves? The Venice one? No. Clive? <laughs> The Sands? No. Ashton? MGM Grand? Sorry? MGM Grand? No. I'm not going to have a go. Go on. The Flamingo. Flamingo. Ah, yes. Yeah. Okay, don't lost any points then. Go on. Uh, which winner of the European Golden Boot in 1992 and 1993 managed a club in the Iron Brew Scottish Third Division in the 2012-2013 season? Sam? Oh, your host. Yeah, because he did win that. Oh, yeah, cool. wow. Well done, great, great. Good That's question. not on the radar, Sam. Yeah, yeah good question. Okay. Uh, which movie has the longest time frame between a theatrical theme release for its sequel, standing at 59? The Wizard of Oz? No. Minus one. Oh, the longest was in the sequel. Michael? No, I thought it was the Wizard of Oz. I said, I said that. I said that. Standing at 59 years and 48 days. The original film was released in 1940 and the sequel was released in 1999. Uh, Preston. You, Jim and Beast? No. 
Ruth? Dumbo? No. Rose? I'm here to eternity. No. Five? No. Ashton? Pinocchio. No. Tony? That was my guess. I'm off your Dev, can I have a guess with it real? Sorry? King Kong? No. Re Rebecca? No. Go on. Uh, you're on the right lines, it was Fantasia. Yeah. And I was doing that. Two in 1940. So, Michael, we're, you and me back at minus one there. Bit. I'm going very backwards on this round. Let's do it. Go. In which mainland European city was the United Kingdom granted a temporary enclave between 1999 and 2002? to allow the trial of two Libyan suspects over the Lockerbie disaster. Ashton. Brussels? No. Hang on, let's get rid of a few of these. Uh, just please somebody help me where Ashton is in there. Uh, Michael. The Hague? No. Preston. The Hague. Same. Not Preston. Laycock. Athens? No. Giles. Paris? No. Rose. Oh, yes. Burn. No. Uh, Daniel. Strasbourg. No. Elliot, we're on minus ones here. Ah. Mm -hmm. I'm quite finished the question. Yeah. 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 Right. Could you kind of could you run through it, please? I'm Martin Papel here. Sure. In which mainland European city was the United Kingdom granted a temporary enclave between... Right, and everybody else press. Can I press now without a penalty or something? I've got to get it on there. Right. 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 No minus ones, I think. Yeah. To allow the trial of two of your suspects over, over the Lockerbie disaster under Scottish law. Vienna? No. Sam? No. Tell me. Brussels? I'm going to put it Leeds? Gdansk? No. It was Utrecht. Utrecht. Oh, yeah. <laughs> huh? It was not in the Well, we'll follow that round. It's Go on. Uh, who played Randolph J. Hurricane Spencer in the terrible rip-off of Baywatch called Thunder in Paradise? Oh, yes. Michael. Michael Corbin. Correct. Oh, my God. Are you proud of that one? Keep going. This is why you say terrible, because it was a brilliant series. <laughs> Born in Bombay, India, this person first came to fame by appearing on the artwork of the Commodore 64 game Barbarian in 1987. It would later be... Michael. It's uh, Mike Van Wyke, Wolf. Uh, Correct. Oh, good answer. Gladiator. Yeah. Gladiator, Wolf. Oh, we're more like this, come on. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Bring it on! <laughs> in which Spanish town would you find the border to the British Overseas Territory of Gibraltar? Oh. Alcalicas. Ten miles away. Uh, fuck, it's close. Can you ask for a repeat? Can you ask for a repeat? Yeah. Uh, in which Spanish town would you find a border of, to the British Overseas Territory of Gibraltar? Sam. It is. No. If it's not Alcalica, they're not going to guess it. No. So put them out of misery. It's uh, La Linea. Oh, La Linea, the Conception. Yeah. Damn. I cycled from there to here. <laughs> <laughs> not, not in one go, not in one go. Every inch I've done, every inch I've done. Go on. Um, Charles Kingsley's The Water Babies mm -hmm. is a satire based on which book by the scientist Charles Darwin? Oh, yes! Origin of the Species? Correct. No. No. Well, that was it. a little bogus for me. Was that going to be the monolith of the Cirripedia, was it? The little black dress was made for Tony! Coco Chanel. Nope, I'm quite sure. Oh, hang on a minute. It's, 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 it's the orb anyway, so we're going to Tony! They hadn't finished the question, that's not you, that's not going to be the answer. Debs! Mary Quant. No. Sessler. Sam? Dior. Sorry? Dior. No. Oh, nice one, Tony. Bastard. Uh, Bastard. Bastard. It wasn't going to be your mate. We said it wrong. Sorry? We said it wrong. Lee Hurley. No. Lee. Audrey Hepburn. No. Carry on. Uh, was made famous by Coco Chanel in the 1930s, but which fashion house designed the famous little black dress worn by Audrey Hepburn in the film Breakfast at Tiffany's? <laughs> Clive. Oh, Lee. We have you got? Uh, Clive. Yvonne. Correct. Yeah. Yvonne. Yeah. Got it. 
That's it. What was the one? Three. So, yeah, the uh, break now, yeah? Yeah, we're having a break and then we're going to last